The possibility of life on other planets in the universe is a subject of great interest and debate among scientists, philosophers, and the general public. While there is no definitive answer to this question, there are several factors that suggest that the chances of there being life on other planets are relatively high. One of the key factors that suggest the possibility of advanced life is the sheer size and scale of the universe. There are an estimated 100 billion galaxies in the observable universe, each containing hundreds of billions of stars. Given this vast number of stars and planets, it seems likely that at least some of them would be capable of supporting life. Another factor that supports the possibility of advanced life is the recent discovery of exoplanets, or planets, outside our solar system. Over the past few decades, astronomers have identified thousands of exoplanets, many of which are located in the so-called habitable zone around their parent stars, where conditions may be suitable for life as we know it. In addition to these observational factors, there are also a number of theoretical reasons why the existence of advanced life is plausible. For example, the building blocks of life, such as carbon, oxygen and water, are common throughout the universe, and scientists have shown that simple organic molecules can form in a variety of environments. There is also the idea of the anthropic principle, which suggests that the existence of intelligent life on Earth may not be a coincidence, but rather a natural outcome of the laws of physics and the conditions of the universe. If this is the case, it stands to reason that other planets with similar conditions may also have given rise to intelligent life. Despite the many factors that suggest the possibility of advanced life, there is still no direct evidence that it exists. While scientists have detected some intriguing signals from distant stars and planets, there is no definitive proof that these signals are the result of extraterrestrial intelligence. Nevertheless, the ongoing search for extraterrestrial life remains one of the most exciting and important areas of scientific research today. By exploring the potential for life on other planets, we can learn more about the origins and nature of life itself and gain a deeper understanding of our place in the universe. A group of experts in astronomy recently discovered that a repeating radio signal can be attributed to a rocky exoplanet that possesses a magnetic field, a vital factor that indicates its ability to support life similar to Earth. The planet called YZ Seti B is a planet that revolves around a red dwarf star, situated around 12 light years away from the Earth. Joe PC, who oversees the US National Science Foundation's National Radio Astronomy Observatory program, stated that the quest for habitable exoplanets in distant star systems relies on identifying whether Earth-like planets made of rock possess magnetic fields. A planet's atmosphere is protected from being stripped away by powerful stellar winds due to the presence of a magnetic field. In our solar system, several planets such as Jupiter, Saturn and Neptune are known to possess magnetic fields. Additionally, astronomers have previously discovered indications of even larger exoplanets that have magnetic fields of their own. Until recently, detecting magnetic fields on rocky planets beyond our solar system has been a challenging task, and we lacked a dependable method to search for them. It appears that the repetitive radio transmission may hold the key to this mystery. Australian Telescope Finds 1 Million New Galaxies A powerful Australian telescope has created a highly advanced atlas of the universe. In 2020, the telescope, called the Australian Square Kilometre Array Pathfinder, mapped 3 million galaxies in the span of 300 hours. This is extremely impressive, especially when compared to the preceding all-sky surveys that took years. It is estimated that one million of the galaxies charted by ASCAP have never been observed previously. It all took place in the remote outback of Western Australia, where ASCAP transformed radio signals to images, mapping the sky with a level of detail two times that of previous surveys. ASCAP only needed 903 images to complete the map, while other telescopes needed tens of thousands. From the Australian desert, nearly 500 miles north of Perth, the atlas ended up covering 83% of the sky. This was made possible by ASCAP's 36 antennas, combined with a fiber-optic cable that works to create a single ultra-powerful telescope. ASCAP connects the signals from many smaller dishes, which creates more detailed images while remaining less costly than a single, larger dish.
The three-story high instrument is run by Australia's National Science Agency, the Commonwealth Scientific and Industrial Research Organisation. The telescope's data, which generates at a pace faster than Australia's internet, is received by a supercomputer processing facility in Perth. Researchers hope that ASCAP will help them learn more about how galaxies form and interact. Looking at galaxies billions of light years away helps scientists to look back in time and understand the universe in its earlier stages. The atlas from the ASCAP is a precursor to even more exciting information to come. Scientists believe that there may be up to one trillion galaxies for instruments like the ASCAP to observe. Plus, public data from the telescope will help scientists collaborate and truly make sense of the observations. In fact, an international project will follow soon. The world's largest radio telescope, called the Square Kilometre Array, which will find its home in South Africa and Australia, is currently in the works. It seems we still have more questions than answers about our universe, but scientists are helping us understand more and more at an impressive pace. The stream of fascinating information does not show signs of stopping anytime soon. Proxima D Space exploration is an incredibly exciting prospect. As we develop more technology and learn how best to make use of the science already at our fingertips, we get to explore further into space. Perhaps even better is getting to take a closer look at the places we thought we already knew. Scientists have recently discovered a new planet in the solar system that surrounds the star closest to Earth, besides the Sun. Proxima Centauri is the closest star to our solar system, just under 4.25 light-years away from Earth. The system is formed of two main stars, Alpha Centauri A and Alpha Centauri B, which together form a binary pair, meaning the two stars orbit one another and are bound together via gravity. The next part of this system is the third star, Proxima Centauri, also referred to as Alpha Centauri C. What is particularly interesting about Proxima Centauri is not just the close distance to our own solar system, but also that this star is relatively like our Sun. Scientists have a rather recent cause for celebration, as a new exoplanet, in other words a planet found outside of our solar system, has been found to be orbiting this star, with the research being published as recently as February 2022. This exoplanet is the third planet that has been found within this system. Back in 2016, Proxima b was discovered and the scientific community was thrilled. The exoplanet was a similar size to Earth and hosted conditions that could be suitable for life, with a temperature where we could possibly find liquid water and a rocky surface. Proxima d is a little different. As opposed to the Earth-sized planet it orbits alongside, the newly found Proxima d is one of the lightest exoplanets we have ever discovered, nowhere near comparable to the mass of Earth. The size of this planet is only the start of the differences. The possibly habitable conditions of Proxima b are not present in Proxima d. This newly found exoplanet is far too close to its star for life similar to humans to exist upon it. It orbits so closely to Proxima Centauri that the orbital period is only five Earth days long, compared to the 365 it takes us to orbit our star, the Sun. The discovery of Proxima d has led to several discoveries within this planetary system. Zhao Faria, lead author of the study and a researcher at the Instituto de Astrofisica y Ciencias do Espaço, said that this research shows us that our closest stellar neighbour seems to be packed with interesting new worlds, within reach of further study and future exploration. This goes to show that the great discoveries do not have to stretch across the galaxy thousands and millions of light years away, but that sometimes the most interesting revelations can be fairly close to home. But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.